Hi y'all, and welcome to our review on Potastic <laughs> Dog Colors. Let me get him back into view here. I don't know what's going on with him today. He's been super silly. And these are for Potastic Collars. I think part of it is we don't wear collars. But if we did wear collars, we would wear Potastic Collars. And I've done a review before. They sent me another one to review that is their medium size. My previous review was on the large size, which is the one right here. And I believe the large fits 18 to 26. And I thought it was a nice fit on him. Some people might think it's a little wide for a dog his side. And the, hard, the hardware is definitely large. But um, I like a, a thicker collar. I think it's more comfortable on a dog. Um, and... He's a little weirded out by wearing a collar. As I said, he wears a harness. He has a microchip. We live in an apartment. He um, doesn't really need ID tags. We live in, you know, a third story apartment. There's really nowhere he can go. He doesn't leave the apartment without a leash on. So um, if we do go out somewhere, I suppose we probably should put tags on him just in case and not rely on his microchip. I don't, I guess it's the tag hanging on him. He won't stay on his mark here. Come here. Let's show off. And this design is called Kisses. I think it's so cute and 80s looking. Love it, love it, love it. And um, you can get it in a small, medium, and large. The medium is a bit thinner um, as far as the width across it. And I believe the medium is from, oh my gosh, what did it say? I believe the medium collar goes from 14 to 18. I think that's right. 14 to 18 or 14 to 20. You'll have to check the link that I put below to take a look. And they have so many designs. I mean, you've, they probably have at least a hundred dis different designs in there. They have designs for birthdays, holidays. Uh, this is their artistic one. If you like this one, this one is called Violet Blue and I, no, Lavender Blue. It is called Lavender Blue. I would like it more if it had a lavender buckle to match the lavender collar. Well, someone is just being so naughty. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and take it off him. You know, I can, I can single-handed operation came off pretty easily. Um, as with all dogs, if they're if they're a heavy puller, I don't think that these are an appropriate. Um, that just in general, the snap is an appropriate collar for them. For heavy puller, hush, hush, hush. Solaire. He he's so glad to be free of the collar, as well as I've run out of treats. So you can always trick him, but you know, the, the if if you have a dog and you feel comfortable using this type of collar, this is like a really good um, firm plastic. I wouldn't have a problem putting a dog that I had control over on this collar at all. And as you can see in my hand, um, the pattern is really pretty. It's kind of like um, not really a paisley just like a modern floral, I would say, like an abstract floral. It's pretty. Um, I like the feel of it. It's the um, typical uh, nylon-y ribbon, but then on the inside, it's a really soft, almost padded feeling um, neoprene, like a, like a suit, like a wetsuit. So it's that neoprene, and it's soft. There are no hard, rough edges to chafe your dog. And it, you know, it's got a lot of nice details to it. Uh, the hardware feels like it's in there pretty well. And it's got this little um, soft uh, rubbery potastic logo. And then it's got stitched on with a little ribbon, a place for the, the collars. I don't know if I'd put the tags there. I think, honestly, I would put the tags here just in case, only because the ribbon um, seems like over time it might, uh, you know, fall off. I'm not sure. I've, you know, I've never really been a collar person. I've always either got microchips or, you know, my dog just didn't go out without me. Or um, in the old days when I got into dogs, in the 90s or so, we had tattoos. And I'd like to see tattoos get a comeback. I'm thinking about giving my dog a tattoo, uh, an ID, because microchips, you know, microchips can only work so well. Tags can, only, tags can be taken off the collar. 
So, go ahead and take a look. I mean, at, at the website, I'm going to link it in the comments. And I, I really, I recommend them, these. And I am sure that you're going to find a collar at a really reasonable price that you are going to like. And what a wonderful gift. I mean, they've got birthday ones. They've got... Um, all kinds of holidays. If you can name a holiday, they probably have one for it. Um, seasonal, and um, I'm really happy. I'm really happy with these. In fact, I the reason he's never worn one for anything but uh, just the reviews is because I'm going to gift them, and I think I'm going to gift them to Boston Terrier Rescue Auctions. And I'll probably even buy some more because the price is so good. I believe the last time I looked, they were in the $12 range, and that's really good for a, qua a collar of this quality. But it's much nicer than anything if you went over to PetSmart and took a look at their collars for the same price. I mean, you're you're gonna this is you're gonna be happy with these. All right, thanks for watching. Bye.